uh, to ask the Scottish Government what support it provides to the Scottish Fisheries Museum in Anstruther. Fiona uh, The Scottish Government continues to provide support to the Scottish Fisheries Museum. In the current financial year, a total of 109,000 has been allocated to the museum, covering 75,000 for operational costs and 34,000 for capital expenditure. In 2018-19, the museum received additional in-year funding of 75,000 and a further 330,000 to assist in the refit of the museum flagship. Uh, the museum flagship Reaper um, has had investment uh, as a total from the Scottish Government uh, for of £830,000. The Scottish Fisheries Museum celebrates its 50th anniversary this year and I look forward to join the celebrations that begin on the 4th of July when Reaper returns to its home port of Anstruther. Willie Rennie. I declare an interest as a trustee of the museum and the Secretary is right about the 50 years uh, of this National Museum and they are grateful for the support that the Scottish Government has provided, not just the museum over that time, but also the Reaper. And the special events, including a flotilla of up to 50 boats in early July, will mark a special occasion. But can the Minister perhaps set out what further opportunities there would be to make sure that the museum engages in the wider community right across Scotland to make sure that those communities engage with our seas and the fishing industry? Fiona uh, I, I think the member is quite right to uh, advertise this fantastic celebration and I hope everybody can take part in that. Uh, but we have to do more indeed. Uh, only yesterday at the Scottish Historic Environment um, Forum, we had a session on industrial heritage and particularly how we can engage more people in sites and museums like that of the Fisheries Museum to ensure people understand our very rich heritage, not just in the places of Fife, for example, but further afield.